guys welcome back to our channel so today we have an exciting project for you guys we're going to be using pixel blocks to control an led using a potentiometer so let's get started before we begin let's take a look at what the details of this project are we're going to be using pixel blocks a visual programming software to write the codes that reads the value from a potentiometer and uses those values to control the brightness of an led light sounds cool right so let's get started. Let's take a look at some of the components we'll be using for this project. We'll be making use of our Arduino board. I have Arduino Uno here, a potentiometer, an LED light, I'm using a red LED light, a breadboard, and some jumper cables. So let's get started with our connection. Okay, so now let's go ahead with the connections. We're going to be connecting our breadboard to the 5 volts and GND of our Arduino board. I'm connecting this to GND. And this side to 5 volts. Then we're going to connect our potentiometer next using a male to female jumper. So the first pin of the potentiometer would go to to go to 3.3 volts. Second pin is going to Second pin is going to the analog pin zero. This is pin. Cloud, the last pin is going to G and J. So once we are done connecting the potentiometer to the Arduino board, you are ready to connect your LED light. So like I said, I'm using an a red LED light. So the light based on my red board. Then I'm connecting the short leg, which is the negative leg, to the GND roll of the red board. And I'm connecting the longer leg roll to pin line of the Arduino port. So once you are done, your connection should look like this. Okay, so now it's time for us to write the code for our project. We already know the drill. The first thing to do is to select our board and use it at winner, you know and then connect our board to our system. So it's connected now, we're going to switch to upload mode. Okay. So now the first thing you're going to bring out is when Arduino in the starts up, then your forever. So now we are going to be making use of variables in this project. We are going to be making a variable called write, so you're going to call find it to variables then make a variable and the name of this variable will be writes once you're done with that you're going to bring out set bright to zero then you will go but this variable is where your the brightness of your led light is stored in so you go over to operators and bring out the one with Less than sign, then go to your Arduino unit and bring out read analog pin. And in here, we are going to write four. So, what this line is just basically said is just once it gets the value that is in the LED light, it should divide it by four. 
the brightness is equal to the value of the net light divided by the pop. Okay. So after that, So after this, you're going to bring out your set PWM pin. We are changing this to 9. Remember that your LED light is connected or pin 9, so we are changing this to 9. Then where this 2 pipe pipe is, we are going to replace it with the bright variable. So like this, we have completed the code. Next thing to do is to upload the code. So click on upload code. Upload code. Yeah, so it's building now. So it has successfully been uploaded. So let's check how it works. So now as I turn the potentiometer, the brightness of the net would also change accordingly. I'm turning the potentiometer, the brightness reduced, now it's increasing. Let's try to see a different yet and see if it also works the same. So I'm trying it with like green LED lights now. And that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Remember, if you want to try this project yourself, you can find the code and the list of components in our description below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content. See you in our next video. Bye.